everybody, Sam back once again, and we've got another Nexus video for you. A lot of people have been asking what the new YouTube client looks like, so we're going to give you a quick look over that today, and yeah, let's have a quick look. So obviously this is one that comes on Ice Cream Sandwich, which obviously is only officially on the Galaxy Nexus at the moment. So then, I was going to our Google folder and go to the YouTube, the YouTube, I said it. So we'll start at the beginning. So here's the new home screen, so what we'll do is we'll just zoom in for you. And well, hopefully, that should come off pretty decent for you. There we go. So on here, obviously, it's very similar to the old one um, in a lot of ways. But again, it's also been upgraded quite a bit. So obviously, you get on your home, you get ones that are generally related that you've got in your subscriptions box. So here we go. So, you know, have a quick look at some of those. So... What you can then do is you can either click browse or you can swipe and it takes you to all your different kind of you know different categories so science technology is which i'm based in obviously it gives you all the ones based in that category there and oh look sam's galaxy nexus boxes i am there get in so we'll just have a quick look at what the obviously the picture quality looks like and what you'll see now is watch those buttons they disappear and it gives you the full widescreen experience And oh my word, it's like Inception all over again. So we'll go back. So what we'll do is go back into the video. We're not going to obviously play it properly this time. I'm just going to show what you do get on here as well. So then, what you do get is with the new integration, obviously you can click there and it takes you to the actual YouTube channel, which is showing you a moment. You then get a plus one. So obviously you can plus one it straight away to your Google Plus. Like and obviously dislike. And then obviously all your different, uh, so all the description that I do put there. So check out my website. You know what to do. It's down below on this one as well. Follow me on Twitter. Yeah, go on. You know you want to. Facebook me. Why not? And Google Plus me. You know as. You know on all those social networking sites. And there's related videos. So anyone that's basically made a video that's you know very similar or you know, yeah, very similar. Avoid that video there because that guy's proper annoying. Um, he just posted pictures. It's really, really annoyed me. Um, so yeah, I was just showing you all the related videos and it shows you the comments. So then, if you can see yourself, congratulations. You can kill an elephant with that knife. What? This knife? Yeah, I don't know why I did that. Samsung Galaxy Note is better. Is it? Hmm, who knows? But as you can see, with this new layout, it's all white here, whereas obviously previously obviously it was all kind of like all blacked out. So, you know, it, it looks more more YouTube-y, if that makes sense. And obviously with the newer YouTube update, this is very, very similar to that. Now, obviously when you are in Science Town, you can do most viewed, you can do top rated, most discussed and top favorited. And obviously you could do today, this week, this month and all time. So it kind of brings the, the whole YouTube experience, as you've normally expected, to the phone obviously in a, the mobile platform. So we'll just jump back rather quickly. And obviously from there you can go to your account. And obviously on the account, it's got me. And there we go. We've just managed to have 11,000 subscribers. So thank you very, very much to everybody. And it was that ugly mug. Oh yeah, it's Brandon. So it shows you all your favorite videos, your uploaded videos, your playlists, and obviously all your subscriptions. So if you click subscriptions, it then gives you all the different people you are subscribed to which is pretty damn cool. So let's go through a few here. We see if you can find Brandon's channel. If you're not seeing Brandon's channel, it's, it's me, Maverick Blue. Go check him out. Um, so yeah, you're thinking, well, that's it. Is that pretty much it? Nope. You also get your little settings button up there. So instead of having a menu button, it's all at the top here. So you've got your sign out, your settings, feedback and help. So I've got settings. You then got your general settings. So high quality on mobile, so obviously that's, um, let's say if you're on the, on the run, you're not on Wi-Fi, do you want high quality or not? I do, why not? Caption font size, you can then choose how big you want it, keep it in medium for myself and uploads, or you can choose only over Wi-Fi or over any network. Do Wi-Fi just for now, because I'm doing 1080p uploads. Obviously your search history, clear it, and all that kind of stuff, and then about, just basically tells you obviously about your privacy policies and all that kind of stuff. So, is that is that all it says? Nope, obviously on the main page you do get your little record button. So press that, jump straight into the camera application and now it's ready to shoot. Once it's shot, it starts uploading pretty much instantaneously. So, 
there's a nice quick browse around the new application. Um, it is very similar to the old one, but it's had a quick, nice bit of a, a facelift. If you do go to somebody's channel, just to make you aware, let's see if we can uh, try and go to on this one for you. So let's go to this, my quick video here. Click obviously the person. It then takes you to their channel. So it does tell you everything about them. You can then view their uploads. So it's kind of like going to, obviously on mine, it's kind of going to my account. It gives you all their different videos, their favorite videos. Can't be viewed for some reason, and then their activity obviously tells you what they've been up to. And obviously, recently there's a lot of Gam Samsung Galaxy videos, and obviously my playlists. So, go check them out. I've got my Galaxy Nexus, which this one will be in Galaxy S2 vs iPhone 4S, Galaxy S2 vs Sensation, iPad 2, and the all important Samsung Galaxy S2 on its own. And everybody, I think it's been a bit of a probably a lot, maybe a long winded video just for a quick application on tour. If you've got any questions over it, or if you've got any other specific videos you would like to see, because this was a requested by probably about 50 or 60 people, so I figured, why not? People want it, I'll show it. If you want to see anything else, you know what to do, hit me up down below, email me, it's probably one of the best ways to get my attention, is viewers at samjpullen.com, but the best way to get my attention is to follow me on Twitter, and tweet me at samjpullen, which you should see just around here anywhere. Anyway, everybody, I'm going to get off now. Stay tuned for more. I've got a hell of a lot more videos on the way. And I shall see you in my next video. Cheers.